who were working locally in the ministry. And I asked him if he would start meeting with me maybe once a week to pray over this vision. And you know, I was asking him, and what he said to me was, Leora, it's a no-brainer. God has called you to steward this. Now, I've been carrying it and I'm ready to give birth. Um, I am going to open the floor to some people that are here that have danced with me. And if you want to share a breakthrough that might have happened to you, I can, I can, give, a, I can give a testimony about Adina. I've seen, I've seen joy come on Adina. When she, when she dances, she becomes someone else. I'm serious. Because we all have burdens, right? But when she dances, she just becomes this butterfly so full of joy. It's true. Is there anyone here who wants to share a testimony? David or 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 Scott? Um, Sigal? Anyone here who wants to share a testimony of what dance has done for them? And you don't have to be afraid. Come on up. I just felt to open the floor. Let's do that. There was a season we had uh, classes here. Actually, I'm still praying maybe it will come back. Uh, I really loved this uh, uh, school of, uh, of, of dancing here. And uh, uh, God opened the new, new things for me. Like, I, I, I never was into arts before. And uh, I started to visualize, visualize uh, a picture. And I came, came home, I could, I could uh, make the picture. It wasn't such a good picture, but the picture in my mind was so good. <laughs> this is the thing, the vision. It also, I think it also said, changed a lot of the composition. I shared it with the aura. It made it much more complicated because of the dance. So I believe all the, uh, really the dance uh, do big breakthrough in the soul and in the, the creativity of, 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 of man. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I also want to say, when Ifrat said complicated, that's not the word she meant because that has a negative connotation. What she meant, I remember, I'm, I'll tell you, the day she came up to me and she said, I find that my compositions are much more complicated, but what she meant, we talked about, is they become much more intricate, like deep, there's more to them, right? So in intricate would be the word. And also, I would like to share, when we were here together, um, when we did the warm-up and we were using our voices, because our voices are very important, we get a breakthrough. When we can shout to the Lord, and we're not afraid. When you shout to the Lord, it's like when you lift a switch on and the cockroaches run. This is a powerful weapon when you're praising God. So when we were having our warm-up, Ifrat was warming up, I remember, and we were doing an emotion dance, and she was crying, and I thought she was like acting the part of what we were doing, and she wrote me later, and she said those tears were real. Through the sounding, through releasing the sound, the Lord showed her that she had some stuff in there that she needed to bring to the Lord. We all do. You see, when you are not afraid to let the sound out, Trauma can come out of your body. Do you know that we hide trauma in our body? We have trauma in our joints, trauma in our bones, trauma in our necks, trauma in our vertebrae. We've got to get the trauma out. How do we do that? By praising the Lord with His voice and bringing the worship dance with it together. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And Ephraim also has, she also has um, an interview on YouTube about how the Lord has set her free through the dance. This is Barb. I'd like to share, I was really blessed when the dancers would put their flag or their billow over people's heads or um, when the lady um, put the wings over me. And it reminded me when I was a child, I had um, really awful things happen to me as a child. And actually, um, when those things happened, Jesus put his feathers around me. He came where I was as a, as a helpless child, and he put his feathers around me, and that's what that reminded me of when, when that was around me. It was like, it just um, was so meaningful, real inner healing. So thank you very much. 
Does anybody else want to share? Oh, can you come on up? I wanted to resonate. If you have to leave, um, please feel free to leave a donation for the Woods from Floor. We appreciate it. I try to be a um, short story. Uh, when I was a child, I used to dance to God at home without nobody teach me. Nobody told me to do it, it just happened. Um, and after so long time, next time I met Jesus. Um, so a few months ago, God was asking me to worship in dance. And this morning, uh, I asked God to, to put people in, in my way, uh, God that, to glorify Him. And suddenly I met these two brothers this morning. They, don't, they didn't know anything about the dance, they didn't know anything. And this evening they invited me here. So this was a prophetic time to God made it, and the power of God was around. And So faithful. I don't know about you, but this kind of meeting where people are sharing from their heart, they're sharing their life, they're being included, they're being invited, they're being involved, they're engaged. This makes the Father smile. This is what He wants. Mm -hmm. He wants us all involved. He wants us all engaged. He wants us all to feel loved and accepted from Him through each other in Yeshua's name. Okay, we're gonna pray over the love offering in the name of Yeshua, hallelujah. Father, we just thank you so much. This is the first time that I've ever done this, Lord, in such a situation and, and praying over this love offering. But you know, Lord, you put this vision in my heart, God, and that's why I'm carrying it, Lord, and I'm gonna bring it to pass as I partner with you and you're gonna do it, Lord. I don't know how you're gonna do it, but you're gonna do it. And so, Father, I thank you for the dancers that poured out tonight. I thank you for the guests who came to receive, because it is ministry, to receive and experience something new. Father, we want to bless everyone that's here in the name of Yeshua. Father, I pray that whatever you began to stir up in each person, Lord, that they would run with that. They would not try to put it back into the ground, Lord, but they would allow it, Lord, to be stirred up and stirred up and stirred up and come to the surface. Father, you make all things new through Yeshua, and you show us how to pray. So Holy Spirit, I thank you that you're showing me how to pray. Go before us, Lord. And Father, I thank you that you have the building where you want the floor to be, and you have the dance floor builder, and you have all the money in heaven, God, so we ask you to release it now. In the name of Yeshua the Messiah. Do do do.